So you have a few superpowers. Probably didn't know you're like walking around with all these superpowers going, who, me? Yeah, you. Your breath. Your breath is probably the biggest superpower you have. And guess what? It's free and it's available all the time. So I'm going to introduce you to one breath that I want you to have in your back pocket whenever someone triggers you, activates you. This is called the four, two, six breath. The, the breathing, the four, two, six, that's incredible. And the way that I felt after I did that was incredible. And I really, really appreciate it. And I'm grateful for being able to watch you today. We need to live more consciously to make a difference in our own lives and that of others. Self-care is in danger of becoming a little narcissistic in the world right now. Everything is about me, 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 me. But the reason we go within and we connect within is so that we can connect with other people as well. We're here to help other people. We're not just here to help ourselves. Everything happens inside of us. Nobody can do the work for you. Nobody's coming to save you. Nobody can show up for you in the way that you can. The relationship you have with yourself is the only one you'll have from birth till death. Think about that for a second. We carry everything in our DNA. So when we do the work in Ireland, we believe we're healing seven generations in the past and seven generations in the future. And we carry our trauma. There's a recent research study on mice that they say they have now seen 14 generations that they can prove that we carry the trauma. Now, that means if nobody's done the work for 14 generations, your DNA is still carrying that pain. Your DNA is still carrying that trauma. That's huge. The greatest gift was Allison presents a lot of information and balances it with experience and science, but you come out of it with a very tangible solution or a very, something very tangible that you could actually do. I'm going to invite you to follow the next in-breath deep down into your heart center. And as you do, bringing your full awareness to your heart area. And let's begin to practice heart-focused breathing. Breathing in through your heart and breathing out through your heart. As we breathe in through our heart, we're expanding our heart's energy, inviting our heart into our life, into this room today, into this session. So now I ask myself the question and I encourage my clients to do the same. Stop saying, why is it happening to me? And start asking, why am I creating this? Mm. That's, That's a great. A whole different. It's very uncomfortable. And you have given me the gift of stepping in and having full permission to step into my power and reminded me that the more we scale inward, the more we can serve outward. And breathe out. Two, three, four, five, six. Okay, hands up who feels even a tiny little bit more grounded. Okay, that's quite a few hands going up. It doesn't take an awful lot to make a big difference. And that's what we're learning today. Why is it we don't do the things we know work? One of the things that Allie did that was really great in the event today is that she made it actionable. So while there's this huge to-do list going on, she helped me recognize that at the beginning of the day, yes, I can five five minutes. And at the end of the day, I can find five minutes to focus on this. Now I want you to turn the attention towards yourself. There is greatness in me. There is power in me. There is beauty in me. There is so much love in me that I am so ready to share. And when I leave this conference, I am gonna shine brighter than ever before. And every single person that touches my energy will have permission to shine too. And that, my friends, is how change happens.